The day I came out to my family, I didn't just come out to my family and friends. I came out to the whole world. I made a YouTube video titled, well, you guessed it, I'm trans. And I posted a link to it on the school website. Yeah, I know, it's a hard thing to do, but I thought if one person knows, the whole world might as well know so they can all see me for me. Well, I didn't think anybody was going to watch it because I wasn't very popular, at the time, at least. One view turned into a thousand in less than two hours. Within four class periods, like 8,000 people had seen my video. All of the staff and everything, the whole entire school. I began to panic because... I hadn't even told my family yet. At lunch, people were coming up to me, sharing their stories and thanking me and telling me that I was famous. I just was freaking out. When I got to study hall, period six study hall to be exact, I pulled out my phone to finally send them the link to the video. And well, right there under my name, 10,000 views. I just sat there and watched the number get higher and higher. 10,000, 11,000, 12,000. All during study hall. I couldn't believe it. I was in shock. After school, getting to my locker was difficult. So many people kept coming up to me and asking me questions. I ran home that day. I ran home to find my mom's car and my dad's car in the driveway. My dad lived over 200 miles away. So I stood outside my door for like 45 minutes before I finally got the guts to go inside and face the rejection. I opened the door slowly, trying not to make it squeak like it always has. But when I shut it, it squeaked so loud you could hear the echo throughout the whole house. My mom came running downstairs to find me at the door in tears. She came up to me and gave me a big hug, and she whispered in my ear, I always knew, I love you, son. And I'm really glad I had her then, because my dad just sat on the couch waiting for me to greet him. And when I got there, he just looked at me and said, I wish you would have told me sooner, because then I would have stuck around to spend more time with you and watch football and play catch and do fun things like go fishing. I still don't know whether or not I was offended. Whatever. The day I came out, the whole world heard my story. But mom, she listened.